Hello students, so we were discussing polynomial uh, regression in our last class. And uh, uh, an assignment was given to you, we have been given and to find the value of uh, the following quantities, uh, we had the value of x and y given, the value of x was uh, minus 4, minus 3, minus 2, minus 1, 0, uh, 1, Two, three, four, and five, and corresponding uh, values of uh, x were twenty-one, twelve, twenty-two, twenty-three, forty-five and 67 so you need to find out the polynomial expression uh, which actually is the best fit for these two points now to find out the polynomial expression we uh, first we require the normal uh, equations so the normal equations are derived previously where uh, n a0 plus a1 summation x plus a2 summation x square is equal to summation y this is the first equation first normal equation the second normal equation is uh, a0 into summation x plus a1 into summation x square plus a2 into summation x cube and that is equal to summation x y and the third one is uh, so uh, for each step first equation there was no power of x and uh, for the next equation there is a power of x1 and so for the last one it will be a0 summation x square plus a1 summation x cube plus a2 summation x to the power 4 and uh, last one will be uh, and it will be equal to it will be equal to write the last one once again in the next slide so it will be uh, a0 summation x square plus a1 summation x cube plus a2 summation x to the power 4 it will be summation x square Right, so these are the three normal equations. Now, uh, to find out the values of this normal equation, we need to do the following. We need to actually find the different values of uh, sigma summations. So, first, the summation x, summation x is equal to, if you add, then it will come as 5 summation y will be equal to 204 uh, summation x square will be equal to 85 summation x cube will be equal to 125 summation x to the power 4 will be equal to 1333 uh, summation x 
y will be equal to uh, 513 and summation x square y will be equal to 3193 so if we 93 so if we use uh, these results in the equations we come up with the following uh, three normal equations the two equations are uh, 10 a0 plus 5 a1 uh, plus 85 a2 is equal to 204 this is the first equation second is uh, 5 a0 plus 85 a1 plus 125 a2 uh, it is equal to 513 and the last normal equation is 85 a0 plus uh, 125 a1 plus 1333 a2 is equal to 3193 Now, uh, to solve the values of uh, A0, A1 and A2, we will use here the Gauss elimination method. So first, what we will do, we will take the coefficient of uh, A0 in the first equation and divide the whole equation with 10. Then we will multiply it with the coefficient of a0 in the second equation and then subtract it with this equation so if we name this equation as equation number one equation number two and equation number three the first operation that we will be doing is uh, equation number two minus uh, equation number one by 10 into 5 so if we do the following thing so we will get so we get 5 minus 5 a0 uh, plus 85 a1 plus 125 a2 is equal to 204 and the same thing we can do it for the other uh, steps also that means we can also do it for say uh, a uh, equation number three um, divided by uh, a uh, one one a three one or rather equation number uh, one equation one divided by ten into uh, a to five. So we do it. We also come up with certain equations, and so by keep on keeping on doing this Gaussian causes elimination, we come up with this equation we get 10 a0 uh, plus 5 a1 plus 85 a2 uh, it is equal to 204 this is the first equation then we will get 82.5 a1 plus 82.5 a2 is equal to 411 this is the second equation and the third equation that we get is 528A2 is equal to 1048. So, from these, uh, this is called the triangular triangularization. So it's a triangular form with three terms in the first row, two in the second, and one in the last. It's called 
triangularization so performing this triangularization we in fact get the values of e0 e1 and e2 so we get uh, e0 as uh, 2.07 we get a1 as equal to 3.0 and we get a2 as equal to 1.98 so we use it in the polynomial that is uh, y is equal to a0 uh, plus a1x plus a2x squared so that will make it uh, 2.07 plus 3x plus 1.98x uh, squared. So this is the polynomial and this is the answer.